Well, hello and welcome to another Almost Live. I am This Old Gamer, and I'm thrilled to have you along for the ride today as we are all set for another edition of my Let's Play show. And I'm glad to have you here. And this is going to be an episode where we're going to repurpose a little bit more of this land that is prepping for downtown episode 28. We're also going to tear down some more stuff and do a little terraforming. So let's get started. Now these islands uh, kind of sticking out here just barely above the water. This is kind of how this map was set up. And it looks really cool. Uh, it's a neat little effect. And you can see lots of land underneath there, really close to the surface as well. However, we can use some terraforming and get this uh, leveled out a little bit and just actually allow us to have some additional buildings over here. You kind of got to be careful because we do have this water flow coming out of the canal right here. So I'm kind of a little hesitant to do this, but we're going to do it anyway. Oh, there we go. Let's see how flat this is. Okay, that works out pretty well. So that looks pretty good. This would make a tremendous uh, area for some additional downtown large buildings and all that. But I think I do want to stick this, uh, keep this kind of a industrial zone. Now we see we have a little flooding going on here. That will probably pan out and go away. And we have some water. This right here. So I'll tell you what. Let's do this. Uh oh. Okay. Let's speed it up a little bit and see if this pans out. It might not. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. Go away please. Now that's going to end up underneath the road. Is it going away? Or it's coming up under the road now. Okay. This is a little scary. Look out. Oop. Oh, okay. They're okay. So it's starting to pan out. Let's see. Let's go back to our terraforming. We'll keep it on that high speed so we can just kind of keep a close watch on it. I thought I made that high enough and maybe I didn't. So let's pull this ground level right here. We'll pull this over. Yeah, that looks a little better. That's certainly higher. I'll kind of go around this like so. There seems to be a bit of a jam on the Hank Expressway today. So what we want to do here is we want to come off here and we're going to we're actually going to prep this for some industrial spacing. So I'll slow this back down just a tad. Uh, yeah. So we're going to we're going to kind of come off here for some industrial uh, an industrial zone here. I think what we're going to do is I'm actually going to I'm actually going to make a four-way stop here. Uh, we're going to just use let's use this road here. And I want to just come off right here. All right. Now, that minus 12, we don't want that. We want it to be basically just equal with the road. So, are equal with the surface there. Let's actually bring this up. Okay, that works. I'll come up just a tad bit more. Like so. Thing this is just could be a very large factory area here and we're just going to kind of make a little bit of a, a grid over here we'll use move it and get these nodes up still have the water there on the under the uh, road but it is starting to recite it looks like let's speed it back up just a hair interesting that it's doing that. Let's actually pull this back up. I 
think we can. Can we possibly? Maybe not. Tell you what, let's take this. We'll just push it out to the ocean and maybe that can help get rid of it. Actually gonna make a little bit of a divot here. Get out there, water. There you go. Escape. We'll come back to that in a second. All right, so this is good. Now, what we want to do, we actually want to, we actually want to take this sand and convert it back over just to regular grass. I'll do that all the way around here because we don't want this to look like a beach. Get rid of that pretty sand. Clog it up with some industrial. I'm wanting to do some really big stuff along here. These distribution centers are really cool. Maybe we can just make some really big distribution centers. Okay. Now let's see. Yes, we know we need some water. Let's drag these pipes over here. Like so. Clung magic water sound. Now we're gonna do that again. Cover these gaps. You guys wanna see the zoomed out version of all my piping? Holy cow. As you can tell, uh, not much work has gone into the water in this build or the water flow. Alright, so we have our distribution center and it's raining. Ah. Once again. It's almost live, people. Should I just keep the rain going? Yeah, why not? Um, okay, so we have a distribution center. What goes with a distribution center? Some type of factory would make sense. Let's see what we got to play with. Plastics. These places look really cool, but unfortunately, a lot of times they don't really work all that great with uh, when you're making just a build like I'm doing just for looks and stuff like that they don't they don't always work that great but see they do look really neat so I think that works out all right so we'll just have like a little let's just have like a little access road back here something like one of these just connect it like a little little access road all right I kind of like how that turned out I might actually keep that as like a little bit of a border all right so we have our distribution center so maybe just some like um, let's look underneath our oil we do some of these big oil tanks I think these look cool let's just do some of these What's the, uh, what's this do? Pollution wise, do I have any information on how much pollution this puts out? Let me just look at this pollution map. Okay, this is creating a little bit of pollution. You can see the ground there is turning brown. We want to be careful. We cannot have a repeat of, uh, when I killed half the people in the, uh, Riverview district. I didn't think about having people so close to. Uh, some of my industrial. I definitely need to reconnect this uh, electricity here. Where we go? Okay, here we go. I'll just kind of come across the road and like so. I'm just gonna run this like straight out, like that. Okay, cool. So that gives us some more power. 
Now over here, I'm not going to do all that much detailing. We're just going to kind of throw in some trees. Oop, not like that. We'll actually use our prop line tree doohickey. Right like that. Cool. Simple. Can't help but doing detailing. This will be quick, I promise. Watch. Here we go. Ready? Just gonna do brick wall. Brick wall. that and then we'll just come down here we'll just kind of do some just some random flowers something just to add a little spunk to this area a little industrial zone kind of starting off now here since we do already have this oil tanker let's see Okay, so there they are. This is a balanced mode that we're in. Let's see if we can. Yeesh. I got to be really careful about that. So, da, 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 da. something that's going to go along with the oil. Oil drill. Do I have it? Oh, this is a good one. <laughs> I like the looks of that. What I'd like to do, let me just go ahead and yeah, let's just kind of give this a little bit dirtier look over here. The oil being processed. And we'll do another one of our little access roads. Let's actually bring We'll bring this out a little further. The same thing over here. I'm going to close that in, but let's go back. I want to make... Where was it? I'm going to do like this road. Actually, no, this one right here. Another little connection right there beside that fence. Perfect. I like that. And then, same thing, we're just going to take these trees, and just control C, okay, I'll actually, whoop, get rid of this one, okay, so far so good, alright, so, here I want to put a really large oil refinery, We'll click back on our industrial. Let's do like a big, I want like a big old, where we, what do we got here? Large oil pump, not an industrial area. Now we can, uh, we can fix that. Nope, oh, we're saving. Is this where I'm supposed to drink tea? Let me drink some water instead. Mmm, water. It's too late for tea. So now we can put... Building must be placed. Area has no main building. Okay, and oil. Okay, we'll just do an oil industry main building. Right here. And then we'll put some oil pumps. Like so. We'll just 
sneak a little. Which road do we want to use for this? How about just do this one, come off here like this. Well, you know what? I've got an industrial road that would look about like this one here. No, this one. Yeah. Something along those lines. Kind of dirty this up just a tad. Oop, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, that's how we look on this pollution. Yeah. As long as it doesn't seep out into the water, it's fine. Okay. Just don't want it to seep out into the water, that's all. And we're actually going to use concrete. And we'll just throw in these little concrete blocks. Like so. And tell you what, this looks like a nice place. Yeah, we already got people walking. Why don't we just make this a path? Just do a little dirt path back here. We're gonna turn off our snapping. Just do a little dirt path just like this. Actually, let's just click this so we make sure we get the... Oh, I didn't want to do that. Actually, actually that probably isn't a bad idea. No, actually, never mind. I want to change that back. Let's do like... Uh, Let's do one of these roads here. We'll change this one over like that. That's not what I was expecting. I don't like that one either. Let's go with yeah. Let's go. Let's go with this one. Yeah, just a random concrete. Connect this up like this. I'll probably actually to move this node over just a tad. Okay. And then right here, we will create another oil. I see crude oil. That sounds cool. Let's do that. What is this thing? Oh, that's kind of neat. So we will 
Let's just bring this over here, Ted. Actually, we'll bring it all the way over to the edge of this road. And we'll bring this one over just a tad. And then we can connect our path. Where? Yeah, this path here. Connect down to here. I'm actually going to move that over. Move that over like that. And then put some trees in here. You know, like there's not really a giant oil field. Oh, yeah, we planted all these trees. This is a perfectly environmentally friendly area. Love these palms right here. Okay. Excellent, excellent. Now we'll do some of the detailing of this area later, but I just kind of wanted to get it started over here. As you can see, we definitely have got it started. We've already got quite a bit of traffic flowing through here. Now we can put down our petroleum. What's this other one? Sulfur and yeah, let's go with the petroleum. Oh, that looks so cool. I love that place. Now why will it not connect? It wants to be... It wants to be on that side of the road. It's so weird. Does it got something to do with the electrical lines there? I mean, I know they're there, but... Tell you what, let's just change where it can be. We'll put it like right here. We're gonna just sit it right here. Oh, look at those beautiful pipes. So pretty. These are all part of the Industries DLC, by the way, which opens up some possibilities where you can have these like connected industrial zones. Um, you can actually have industrial zones like uh, uh, kind of work with each other to do different things that you don't can't normally do. Oh, you know what? I tried this before one time. Let's move this factory about right here. And then we'll actually make a road in there, which you have to use just the right road. Let's see if we can find the right one. Something like that. I'm gonna actually move this building over just a tad so that way, yeah. See how that looks like it's meant to be? Low amount of special goods. Make sure trucks carrying them from processing buildings can reach the unique factory. If the missing resource is produced by or in a faraway place, building a warehouse storing it nearby can ensure that there's always some available. Yep, this is going to be a huge area. Man, it is going to actually absolutely boost up my uh, city revenue. And it's going to make some interesting traffic flow here. Well, that about does it for Almost Live Episode 2. I hope you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed building it. As always, a like, comment, or anything else that supports me it is uh, always appreciated. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I know I skipped around a little bit. I'm still trying to figure out the timing on these videos and getting it within a nice time frame. So bear with me. We will get better. And I hope your builds are awesome and you enjoy playing City Skylines. Well, we'll see you next time. I'm the So Gamer. Thanks for watching again. Have a good one. Bye bye.